Hi, and welcome to this edition of Total Warehouse Tutorials. In this video, we will discuss various warehouse layout and product flow options. Your warehouse product flow determines your overall productivity and efficiency. When designing the overall layout of your warehouse, the shipping and receiving placement should be evaluated and chosen based on your available space, product throughput needs, and available resources. Warehouse layout options to consider include U-shaped, I-shaped, and L-shaped patterns. A U-shaped warehouse product flow is the most common type of layout. In this layout, the shipping and receiving docks are located next to one another, offering shared utilization of dock resources such as personnel and material handling equipment. This layout also minimizes product handling, offering high cross-docking capability. I-shaped warehouse product flow and L-shaped warehouse product flow, also known as through flow, are similar in that the shipping and receiving areas are located on different sides of the warehouse. As a result, these require more available space than U-shaped layouts. These layouts can be beneficial for certain operations. For example, warehouses that require heightened security can benefit from the separate in and out areas. I-shaped and L-shaped layouts can also provide larger sorting and storage areas for both shipping and receiving docks, as well as allow for isolated monitoring of each function. That's it for this edition of Total Warehouse Tutorials. I hope you join us for our next one in which we will discuss various conveyor system types.